Alright, so here goes my Vero Speed. It's got a Oakley visor on it. It's got my high school logos on it. I'm missing the stripe though. There's the other one. Brideau chin strap. It's got a w one white one. One white clip because I broke it. Um, it's got a Nike chin protector thing. And uh, most people say you can't put an Oakley visor on this thing for the Rover Speed, but I figured out a way, as you can see. See, it's in. It's in. Look inside. It's in. And it's in. And uh, the only way that I found out how to do it was if you take off this uh, the cage if you take that off and then you put the clips on and you push it in and then hold it in and screw it in that should work and then just assemble it back with these screws and these push points now these push points some people don't know how to use them you just push these this little thing in and then it pops out and then when you're putting it back, you push this back in with like a screwdriver or something, and then it goes right back in. Alright. And, um... I only really wore this for, uh... For my youth football. It was originally a Texans helmet, but I made it like a replica, like high school helmet. And, uh, oh, about the Oakley visor. I don't know if you can see, but... Hang on. About right there. Can you see that? No, he can't see. Anyways, people say Oakley visors cannot scratch and won't scratch very well at all, but they will. This is my brother's visor, and he used it for one's, like, his spring game. And all right here, it feels gritty and sandy because it's all scratched up. And the fog part of it, the fog layer that scrapes off pretty easily. But all in all, it's a pretty good visor. I personally haven't used one. I use Nike usually. But yeah, I'm planning on using the Oakley. Um, that's the inside of it. Let's see? Oh. Nice padding. The only problem with it is it heats up very well fast and it's pretty damn heavy it is um this is what it looks like on me Let's see all in all it's a pretty good helmet it protects you very well I'll tell you that right now it wasn't until I switched to a shut helmet that I got concussions. I've had two. I never got a concussion and never hurt my head in this helmet. It's an amazing helmet. And yeah, that's my review. Thanks.